Hello, Jawa. What? Oh. Oh yes, swoop racing. There's swoop racing on this planet, but there are also Dark Jedi! Lord Malak was most displeased when he learned you had escaped Taris alive. He has promised a great reward to whoever destroys you. Well, it shall not be you. I see you're draining my life. Looks like I'm... Oh, no, but I'm not blocking it. But, I... I shall knock you down! I g What the fuck? You knocked me into the swoop racing den! You idiots! I, Garland, shall knock you all down! If you're still here... Okay, there you are, good. I shall flirtize you! Oh my god, is that a purple lightsaber? I thought Dark Jedi only, only had red. Oh shit, 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 no, 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 no. <laughs> Running into swoop registration, apparently, apparently I can completely exploit this. And oh look, I can level them up. And those of you who are actually interested in seeing how I level people up, well, I normally, with the skills, often just say recommended. Especially with these guys that I don't use very often. Sure. And heal myself. I'm totally... <laughs> you probably shouldn't be able to do this, but I guess they wouldn't want to go inside. You know, it, it, it's a logical way to escape conflict. It's logical enough, right? I mean, come on. Oh, that guy, that guy has a purple lightsaber too. That's awesome. I love purple lightsabers. Let's see if I can get one. Oh, there's a double... Ooh, some nice loot there. Let's see an assassin pistol. And some roommate. Yeah. Nope, we only got the red stuff. That's too bad. So, does T3... Do you have dueling or two-handed? No, you don't. What would happen if I put another weapon on you? Yeah, might as well. Might as well. I'll give you an assassin pistol. Sure. Something I almost never do, but I've already done it twice in this LP. Go figure. I'm on Tatooine, and there are Jawas, and Mission wants to talk to me again, but I can't see her eyes, because she's wearing enormous goggles that make her shoot so much better. Hello, Mission! I want to know a little more about you! Really? You want to know about me? Yes! Nobody's ever really been interested in me before. Well, I am. I want to know. Where are your parents? Don't you have a family? Big Z's my family, you know? My parents, well, I, I guess they're dead. It was just me on my own until the day I saw Zalbar in the lower city. I could tell right away he was in trouble. This was before the gang wars were out of hand. But even then, ah. the Volkers were scum. Scum! They were hassling Big Z, trying to pick a fight. Scum! Looking for trouble. Scum! I'm going to continue singing in the key of E flat. E flat. Okay, maybe I'll actually stop now. Go on. Anyway. I don't like the Volkers at the best of times. And when I saw them picking on this poor Wookiee, all alone on a strange planet, overwhelmed by the big city, I just lost it. I screamed out, leave them alone, you core slimes, and charged right at them. Well, one of them saw me coming and slapped me so hard he just about knocked me cold. You're lucky he didn't fly fly you with a bra fly you with a braster? <laughs> fry ugh. Hey, I don't need a lecture from you. You ain't my mother. I knew what I was doing. Those vulgars didn't scare me. They're nothing but cowards. I knew how to deal with them. Of course, I never got the chance. I guess Zalbar didn't like seeing me get smacked around. He let out this howl and yanked that vulgar a meter up off the ground and held him there by his throat. Did Zalbar kill him? Are you kidding? Big Z ain't like that. Oh, excuse me. Yes. Of course, the vulgars didn't know. What I said is the so offensive. Ran off. Can't say I blame them. 
The first time you see an angry Wookiee up close, it isn't a pretty sight. I thought Zalbar was gonna rip that punk's arms off and beat him to death with his own fists. The Volker was so scared, he fainted. Or maybe it was Big Z's breath just knocked him out. I keep telling Zalbar to brush those choppers of his, but he never listens. Just stay upwind when he's speaking and you'll be fine. Anyway, I knew those Volkers would be back with friends, so I grabbed Zalbar and we took off. Ever since then, we've been a team. We look out for each other, you know? How did Zalbar end up on Terrace? He was fleeing some kind of trouble back on Kashyyyk. That's all I know, really. Kashyyyk, eh? Big Z doesn't like to talk about it. In case you didn't notice, he's the strong, silent type. Doesn't much yeah, matter to me, though. I, noticed I accept that. him for what he is, not what he was. He and Zalbar yeah. like to live in the present. How did you survive before you met Zalbar? Hey, what's that supposed to be? Oh, well, I, I mean... You think I can't take care of myself? Uh, I've got streets. I, I, I know how to get by on my own. In fact, I look out for Zalbar more than he looks out for me, you know? He's a little bit too gullible to make it alone on the mean streets of the lower city. Yeah, true. Anyway, we should get back to the task at hand. Yeah, I suppose you're right. Like I used to tell my brother, fast talk and slick words don't get the job done. Wait a minute, I didn't know you had brother. My brother is a touchy subject, you know. It just so happens, I don't really feel like talking about him right now. Nothing personal. Let's just get back to the business at hand, okay? Alright. Sorry, mission. Uh, wait a minute. What, are, what, the, what are you doing here? Dead people. Why am I going this way? I'm going the wrong way. I seem to have a tendency to do this. And there is one of the two suns, and you can see the bottom of the sun flare of the second sun. The sun flares on this planet actually aren't very good, honestly. And, you know, like, since you can't move the camera up, at least not to my knowledge, you can't see the second sun hardly at all anyway, you can just sort of see, like, that sort of half ring. But yeah, I mean, just look at that, that that's not a very good sun flare, honestly. They, did a much better job with the sun on Dantooine. Honestly, it's a little bit disappointing. Everything about this planet is disappointing, honestly. Although, to be fair, we're out of Dantooine, and that's my least favorite part of the game, so I do like this part a ton better. This is just my least favorite part of the four, the four planets that we had a choice between. Anyway, here is Yukalaka. <laughs> Oh, what do you have available in your shop? A protocol translator. Hmm. Oh. Let me ask a few questions about this HK-47. What functions have you tested? Okay. Yeah. What does the HK-47 designation mean? Ah, retired model, gotcha. I'm interested, let's talk price. It understands sand people dialect and I need to talk to them. Could I convince you to lower the price a little bit from 5,000 credits? I don't have that much. That was quick. Desperate to sell? Yeah, I'm not the type to bite right away, but... You know, I still can't pay that. I'm... Can I convince you to go lower? Come now, think of the advertising you'll get from me. <sighs> I still can't pay that, I'm sorry. Not interested, goodbye. Now, how many credits do I actually have? I, oh, I actually do have 4,000 credits. Well, let's try haggling a little bit. I have a couple more questions about HK-47. Blah, blah, blah. I'm interested, let's talk this. Oh, come on, I can't try a Persuade again? 4,000 is fair, I'll pay it. 
Oh, come on, you didn't even expect... God, you... Fucker. Ugh. Anyway, now maybe you can do me a bit of a favor. I'm looking for something called a star map. If you hear it, it's an exotic. Hmm, okay. Did the Jawas bring you this HK? This HK unit? Ah. So... Okay. Ah, look! There's my nose! It's a fine nose. Hello, HK-47. 